Miss Hellion. What's up guys, my name is Nightwalker Lots, and I have been the developer for the Icebreaker uh, menu for Black Ops 3 for quite some time. Um, it's been an Infinity Loader exclusive for a while, but I figured I'd finally just release it for free for everyone to use. Um, so I'll give a short tutorial on how to actually inject this. First of all, you're going to go ahead and watch the video in the description below. That video is going to be on the T7 compiler by Sirius. You're going to need that to inject this menu. Once you've got that situated, also join their Discord because they're they're good people. Uh, once you got that situated, it's going to go ahead and you know populate all these files for you that you would need to have the compiler run in the first place. Um, so pretty much all we want to want to do is uh, first of all we want to open our game real quick. All right, so we do have the game open now. Now what we're going to want to do before anything else is we want to make sure that we're on zombies mode before we do anything. If you try to inject this menu into multiplayer or campaign, it will crash. Uh, so now when we get all this uh, stuff installed for the T7 compiler by Sirius, after you get that done, all you just want to do is find the directory of where that T7 files are uh, and then open this uh, debug compiler.exe that's inside of there. And it's going to open up a command prompt menu. Now, in the description of this video will be a link to my Discord server. I'll be sure to label it my Discord server, something along those lines. And inside that Discord server, after you get verified and all that cool stuff, I will go ahead and, and it'll probably be a channel called Call of Duty or something like that. I will have a download uh, file um, of this file right here, a something along the lines of a GSCC uh, file. I'll probably go ahead and name it icebreakerv4.gscc. Um, but pretty much once you download that file from my Discord server, uh, in the command prompt window, you're just going to hit I to inject script, and it's going to ask you for um, a path. After you hit inject script, uh, all you want to do is take the GSCC file that you've gotten from my Discord server and just drag and drop it into the command prompt window and make sure that we have, you know, the command prompt window selected and just hit enter. And I'll go ahead and... Um, inject the um into the game and all that cool stuff so now that we've done that we can just close out of that and minimize this real quick uh so now we'll go ahead and see um that injected properly um it's not like infinity loader where this huge message pops up saying hey you've been injected uh nothing really happens in game um but as soon as we load into a map we'll see uh that we do in fact have the menu injected properly um, and it's kind of just that simple, really. I wanted to try to find a way to make this as simple as possible for people, and I figured this was the best way is just using um, the T7 compiler by, by Sirius. Um, that was a big lag spike. 
Um, so that way people can just download a file and drag and drop it and inject uh, just like that. So whenever I post updates on this uh, on this menu, um, pretty much all I have to do is just update the GSCC file, and you guys can keep a up, almost up, always up to date version of the menu. Just to recap here a little bit, pretty much we're going to go to the video that's in the description by Sirius of how to install his T7 compiler. Um, after you have all that installed, you're just going to go ahead and open the debug compiler.exe once you find the directory. It took me a little bit. Um, download the GSCC file from my Discord server, also in the description below. Hit I in the command prompt. Drag that sucker over, hit enter. Hello, hit enter, <laughs> uh, and then you are injected. It is that easy. Uh, so join the Discord, and I will see you guys there. And I'm most likely going to keep tinkering with this menu, keep adding stuff. So there's going to be updates to come, uh, most likely. This v4 version will not be on Infinity Loader. It's going to be exclusively on my Discord server, and from then on. Um, so that way people can just use it for free and all that cool stuff and provide me feedback and um, interact with me mostly. So I do appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully this helped and hopefully you guys love this menu. Uh, and also if you watch this far, make sure to subscribe because this is all I do is I just post stuff that I think is cool. Um, so thank you and peace out. I don't want to go back. Either you can come and save me or just let my heart collapse. Either you can come and clean me or let me fall into relapse. Either you can come and save me or just stab me in the back. I don't want it to go back. I don't want it to go back. Yeah.